All right, viruses turn up in the news all the time. HIV, which we'll talk about a lot, uh, of course, has been in the news ever since its discovery in the early 1980s. But on the other hand, SARS appeared once in our environment as a, as a potentially lethal virus. Uh, SARS com came out of the animal world uh, to cause a relatively small number of deaths uh, before we got it under control. Smallpox is a virus that used to be rampant in our environment. We've actually gotten rid of it. And as far as we know, it only exists in two places right now, in freezers in Russia and the United States. Influenza is a virus that's continually in the news because it keeps changing itself, comes back every year in a different form, and now we are particularly worried about whether the avian flu uh, will become a human flu. There are some very famous incidents in which viruses just appeared out of the wild. Marburg virus appeared in Germany. It turns out it come from uh, Africa, uh, killing a significant fraction of the people it infected. Then later, another about 10 years later, Ebola virus appeared. Ebola uh, is extremely lethal in that form, although there are other benign forms of Ebola. Hanten virus appeared in the four corners of the United States in the desert uh, as a virus coming out of rodents, also extremely lethal. To the, to the relatively small number of people infected. And Norwalk virus is a very different sort of agent. I put it on here uh, because it turns up periodically in the news when there's a cruise ship that, uh, in, in which people get infected with a diarrheal virus. That's norovirus or Norwalk agent.